Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah. Thank okay, you. no problem. Police body cam captures a heartfelt reunion. A Brownstown Township family reunited with their 95-year-old loved one after he went missing. Having the use of a canine quickly uh, really saved, uh, I think it saved him in this case. Lieutenant Andrew Starzak says the elderly man was visiting the U.S. from Canada and spoke limited English. Sunday night, the man's family frantically called Brownstown Township Police after he went for a walk and didn't come back. One of the concerns was uh, that the, the gentleman did not have a cell phone. There's really no way to communicate with him. You couldn't track him like you can with uh, younger people that always have their cell phone attached to them. But Flat Rock Police K-9 officer Xander doesn't need technology. He just needs his nose and his handler, Sergeant Brian Tetro. We always try and rush to those things because time's, time's the, the key to it. Brownstown Township Police called the pair to join the search by the family's home near King and Inkster. He started doing his thing and we started tracking and you know his nose is a lot better than mine so we went about a couple hundred yards out and then uh, all of a sudden he came right up to him and started sniffing his feet. The man fell in a small wooded area and couldn't get up. He also couldn't be heard calling for help. After treatment for minor injuries, the man came back to his family's home, an emergency quickly turning into relief. From the start of the track to the end of the track, I'd say even less than a half hour. When you can find somebody who is, what are you doing, um, who is, uh, you know, lost, confused, usually elderly or children, um, that's like the find of a find of a career because you're actually helping somebody. Now Tetro insists he's no hero, but he says he knows one. Xander is, not me. I'm just a guy at the end of the leash. He tells me where to go. So he, uh, and I don't look at it that way. I look at it, we're doing a job that we love to do, and I'll do it every day. Xander also goes to different community events and visits schools as well. I'm Veronica Meadows, Fox 2 News.